hello and welcome to this binance tutorial so in today's tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to get registered on binance and how to verify your binance account so this is going to be a binance series where i will take you from the registration phase through the verification and how to make money with cryptocurrency trading on binance so everybody uses binance all over the world right binance is the number one cryptocurrency exchange in the world today and i'm intentionally doing this tutorial on my phone because we all trade with our phones in nigeria it's easier to trade with your phone i can do this on a laptop but most of us trade with our phones so i'm going to use the phone interface so that you can understand it very easily so the number one thing you need to do is to go to your play store on android or to your itunes store on iphone and you download the binance app you can also register on the binance website without using the app but it's more convenient using the app so after downloading the app this is what you are going to this is what it looks like this is the interface first you have the home this is the home interface this is the market interface where you see the sports futures and zones we'll talk about all this later and this is the trading interface this is where you trade and make money this is the futures interface so to register at the top you can see login and register at the top of my screen so i'm just going to click it and so we'll click register instead and to register you can register with your phone number or with your email they're asking me for my phone number now but i would like to register with an email so i'll click register with email so you input your email so to register with email you input your email address i'm just going to input my email address now and create a password for myself then you agree to binance terms of use and that is all you need and if you have a referral you can enter the referral code here and when you enter the referral code you and the referral is going to earn some money i'm going to leave my referral code in the description box below so if you want to register you just impute that referral code so after imputing an email address and creating a password you remember and you click agree to binance terms of use you click this arrow and it will take you in so very security verification you just do this simple security verification just to confirm that you are not a robot so you let this lap let it mark okay i think that should work yes so they will send the verification email you send the verification code to your email and you just impute that verification code quickly before this time expires So this is my verification code. So now that we have a Binance account, we can now see that our wallet is showing. It wasn't showing before, but now we now have a new account and we can log in. There's yet another thing you need to do after creating a Binance account. You need to verify your identity. Binance needs to know who you are. Because you are going to be trading cryptocurrency, you are going to be trading with other people around the world and around the country. And they need to know who you are so they can verify your identity and they will be able to track you. For example, in Nigeria, because of the cryptocurrency band, you cannot transfer, you cannot do bank transfer. The only way you can deposit money into your Binance account is through P2P trading, which is peer-to-peer. -peer, where Binance will connect you with other people that want to sell. These are people that want to sell their cryptocurrency so the only way to deposit money into your binance account and start trading is to buy from one of these people you can decide to buy usdt you can decide to buy bitcoin you can decide to buy bus you can decide to buy bnb which is the binance cryptocurrency but to do this to be able to buy to deposit you need to verify your account let's try and buy i'm trying to buy now and because i have not verified this account they are telling me that you have not completed verification you have not completed identity verification please complete the verification so we're going to decide to verify now or skip for later so in this video i'm going to show you how to verify your binance account so you can start trading you can start depositing money and start making money in nigeria on binance so let's verify now so to verify your binance account so you can start trading on binance we'll go back to the home and come to this your account yeah your profile here and on the right on the top right you can see where it's written verify on the top right in yellow here so we'll just click verify all you need for this verification process 
is a government verified a government um, id card a government identity card in nigeria so in nigeria you can use your voters card or your national identity card your driver's license or your international passport so you need to have one of these government id card that is what binance recognizes and that is all you need to verify your binance account on binance and after your verification you can now trade and make money and after your verification you can now trade and make money on binance so now they said confirm your residential country here your privileges and limits could change based on your selection so i'm in nigeria so i'll just click nigeria it's already showing nigeria there so yeah nigeria is fine so i have selected nigeria as my country of residence and you need to note one thing on binance there are three type of verifications there's the basic verification there's the intermediate verification and they all have different requirements and this is the advanced verification and as you can see the advanced verification requires all intermediate requirements and proof of address for your proof of address you can use your bank statement your electricity bill or any of that and for the intermediate for the basic you just need your personal information for the intermediate the the requirements are all basic requirements government id card and your official verification and these are the limits for the intermediate as you can see on my screen so we can start with the basic verification and just click verify now to, to verify your basic information so you impute your con country of residence mine is nigeria and i will just put my name in here so um i'll put my name okay put my name here and this name you are putting has to verify and this name you are putting here has to correspond with the name on your on the id card you are going to use later so make sure you are imputing the right information so i have imputed my name my middle name and my date of birth and i'll just click continue so now i have to put my address So I've imputed my address and I'll put continue. So I have completed the basic verification now. So as you can see, they said basic verified, start trading now or choose to upgrade to a higher limit. With this basic verification now, you can do some things on Binance, but you are still limited. But you can choose to upgrade at any time. You want to go to higher limits and do higher things on Binance. But some people are just fine with the basic verification on binance so if what you want to do on binance the basic verification allows you to do it fine but if you want to do higher things and you are limited you can always come back here and upgrade to a higher limit and when you want to upgrade to a higher limit the same process we took to upgrade the basic verification is also the same process they will ask you for some things you just impute them they will ask you for your for like if you want to upgrade to the intermediate um level they'll ask you for your government identity and facial verification so you just follow step by step and you will do that in the advanced in the advanced unlimited verification they will ask you for your proof of address i told you you can use your bank statement or your electricity bill or any other bill you have and they will accept it they will just ask you step by step and you can go ahead and impute those things and once you impute them and they are clear and they match you have to know that the name you gave to Binance as your name has to match with the name that is on your identity card or any document that you are going to submit to Binance. So whenever you are imputing any name, be sure that you have the documents that match with those names. If not, it will not be verified. But once the name tally and you give them the um, documents they require, Binance is going to verify your account immediately. So um, let's see what we can do with our basic verification. Let's see if we can do um peer-to-peer -peer trading and deposit money in our binance account so as you can see they are still not allowing us to do peer-to-peer -peer trading on binance even with our basic verification 
because peer-to-peer -peer trading has to do with sending money and with the basic verification they will not allow you to do that because it is very sensitive so you have to send some very important documents for them to be able to allow you so if you want to upgrade you come to verify again let's upgrade to a higher level So we have verified the basic verification but it's still not allowing us to do the things it's still not allowing us to buy and deposit money in our binance account and that way we cannot trade and make money on binance so let's go to the next level of verification which is the intermediate level let's try to verify they said review time 10 days well sometimes it takes less than 10 days for them to review your document for this intermediate verification you need all your basic requirements the names and other things you sent you need a government id card like i said and you need a facial verification where you just use your phone camera to just show them your face they want to see that you are a real human being and the facial verification is also to verify that the face on your document is your face that you are not using someone else's document so when they see that the face on your document is the same with the facial verification you do where they will ask you to face your front camera on your phone and verify your face when they see that your face matches with the face on the document you submit binance will definitely verify your account so let's try to verify that now and see how the steps the steps is very easy they just ask you for some things and you give it to them and in few days less than 10 days my account was verified so intermediate verification country of issue nigeria use a verified government issued document so they said only the following documents listed below will be accepted all other documents will be rejected so government issued id card your international passport or driver's license so is either use your driver's license your international passport or your government issued id card which can be your international and um, which can be your national id card or your voters card so um let's use voters card so you click that so the steps are pretty easy right they tell you everything they require intermediate verification upload image of id card so this is the so you can see what they want you to do they have even snapped an example there the first one is good they show you that you need to snap it clear all the edges of the id card has to show you need to snap the front and the back of the card so it has to be a government issued id card it has to be original full size unedited document Place the document against a single colored background make sure that the image is readable they can see what is written on it well littered make sure there is enough light don't snap it in darkness and let the image be colored no black and white image no edited or expired document and and the size of the document has to be between 10 kb kilobyte and 5120 kilobyte and the format of the image has to be jpg jpeg or png format so just to show you how to upload your id card on binance app to be verified so, so now i have uploaded my id card the front page and the back page and i'll click continue the next phase is to take a selfie of yourself so as you can see this is the example they have given so you just scroll down you can decide to take a picture of yourself live or you can decide to upload a picture that i've already taken before so i will just snap um, i will just upload a picture from my photo gallery so at this point you need to upload your selfie uh, i didn't put my selfie here because this is just a demonstration video but note the picture here is supposed to look something like this one here so make sure it's very clear where you snapped it is well littered and after uploading it you click continue So the facial verification is the next and final step so to do this the instructions are avoid wearing hats avoid wearing glasses avoid using filters and use enough lightning so in this facial verification you'll be required to show your face in motion you use your front camera and you will show your face in motion make sure where you are is well lit so your face can show very well and the face of the person doing this facial verification has to be the same face with the person that took the selfie and the same face of the person on the government id card that we selected 
So this is the final stage. After doing this stage, the robot will detect your face and it will submit it to Binance and the Binance team is going to check it out, verify all the information you sent, verify your face and if it matches with the document you submitted and the selfie you submitted, Binance is going to verify your account in at most 10 days, sometimes less than 10 days. And if anything doesn't match, they will tell you what you need to adjust. What doesn't match, if it's not clear, they will tell you it wasn't clear for you to re-upload. And that is how to register on Binance and to verify your Binance account. After verifying, then you can start trading and start depositing into your Binance account and start making money on Binance. So, um, so I don't think it's necessary for me to do this for you, but let me just show you what it will look like. So I'll just begin verification. I'll click verif begin verification. And you see that it will bring up yes yeah, so um so you you fix your face into this what is right there now and the robot will tell you what to do see they said please rotate your phone vertically they just want to know that you're not a robot is really your face so if i if i put my face into this circle now of a man's image there they'll tell me what i need to do and when they are satisfied the robot is going to submit it and that is the final stage of this verification and when it's submitted, Binance team is going to check it out and they are going to verify your account if everything, if you have done everything according to what they ask you to do. So it is really simple to do this step by step. So this is the final stage of the intermediate verification. So the third type of verification is the advanced verification. And you can only do this after completing the intermediate verification. As you can see at the bottom of my screen is written after intermediate. So what you require to do this is to complete the intermediate verification. After doing that, you now submit your proof of address and you can use your bank statement for your proof of address or your electricity bill for your proof of address. So doing this is very easy. They've made it very easy and very basic for the layman to be able to do it. And within 10 days, your Binance account will be verified. So to go to this final stage, you have to finish the intermediate stage and submit your proof of address. And after that, you are good to go. So that is all about registering and verifying your Binance account. So if this video was helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Any comment you have, leave it in the comment section below. Follow this page for the Binance series. After this verification series, I'm going to show you how to trade on Binance, how to make money, and all the tricks I use on Binance, all the strategies I use on Binance to make money. So watch this space for more videos. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Cheers.